Yo, what is going on everybody? It is Randizus. Thank you so much for clicking on the video. Today we're going to be talking about Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War and more specifically Black Ops Cold War's progression system. Guys, if you are new or returning and you haven't, please hit that subscribe button. I'm trying to reach 1,000 subscribers by Christmas and would love your help. But without further ado, let's get right into it. Now, to preface this, we don't have any concrete information regarding Treyarch's new progression system, but from some deductive reasoning that I will share to you, I think I have a pretty good idea of what it's going to be. There are several key points that I'd like to point out. A few months ago, Treyarch made a blog post about Black Ops Cold War. It was before anything was confirmed yet, and they basically told us that they've consumed a huge amount of feedback from over the years and are putting everything that they've learned into this game, which is obviously very much marketing. However, I do think that there is some truth to this. What have they learned from Black Ops over the years? People like the arcade style, they like a balanced game, they don't like specialist, and they liked ranked mode. Ranked mode has been in every single Treyarch game since Black Ops 2, and it's always a very important and loved mode among the community. Not even mentioning the skill-based matchmaking scandals, people would like another ranked mode. We also know that progression will be shared through multiplayer, campaign, and zombies. Very similar to Modern Warfare. We don't really have any other official confirmations from Treyarch at this time. What I think, and frankly hope, the progression system will be is a mix between Modern Warfare and a ranked mode. I can see seasonal rank resets returning once again, even though the community has begged for a prestige mode because every season they see an insurgent of players and it was probably healthier for the game over the long run. Whereas, unless you care about that grind to 10th prestige, most people get bored with seemingly endless levels. Now, I cannot see them doing the same 100 levels per season again because frankly this current system sucks and a lot of people have voiced their concern for this progression system. However, I can see them implement a half level, half skill rank to their overall rank. How this could work is a base 55 levels, much like Modern Warfare, that determines your underlying skill rank. And then once you pass level 55, each level increase is based off of your skill. Now, I don't know all the information that Infinity Ward currently grabs from you. I do know it's a mixture of a bunch of things, including but not limited to how much distance you cover, how many times you crouch slash lay down, how many times you jump, how many headshots you hit, your accuracy, overall damage, how many kills you get, how fast your response time is from when an enemy appears in your field of view to when you first shoot a bullet, etc, etc, divided by per match you play. And then the only way to level up would be to get better at the game similar and ideally more complex than Halo 3's leveling system where you gained one experience point per match one and in order to reach the highest level you needed like 50,000 experience points or something like that feel free to correct me if I'm mistaken in the comments I do think that they're moving towards something similar to this way of matchmaking they said in their blog post that they see what the community says they see that the community hates skill based matchmaking and it deeply desires for a grind now we know that they're not going to just take out skill-based matchmaking it's too important for them to capitalize on newer unskilled players which is why if they add a progression system where people can grind to the top skill rank and reset it every season it gives the hardcore community one to grind for something again and two to have something to show for their skill-based matchmaking instead of just assuming that you're a god and that you get matched up with other gods by the way speaking of getting matched up with gods i was in a game with symphony and i killed him like and subscribe i think that they need this new progression system desperately they either do this or they go back to Black Ops 4 style, minimal skill-based matchmaking and a ranked mode. Or they have the entire game a ranked mode and call it a day. They get to say they innovated and tried to give the community what they wanted. Even if everybody hates it, they tried. They took a chance. There's no way that they're going to go back to the old progression system. I would prefer it, but if it was, then they wouldn't have made a big deal about their new progression system. I'm telling you. You heard it here. They're going to incorporate ranked mode into public matches. That way they don't have to get rid of skill-based matchmaking. Making. But guys, that's all my theories. Thank you so much for watching the video. If you liked the video, like the video. If you loved the video, subscribe down below and let me know in the comments section what you think of my theory. Peace out.